in making this face, you don't get stuck like that. You want to see a face, Barry Green Lucy? You want to see a face? Hello. I've got something new. Look at him. He blink. Ta 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 ta. I I love this thing so much. He blink. He blink. Twisted <laughs> Barbie. Hello. Flap flap. Twisted Barbie just raided with eleven viewers. Raiders, my name is Chimkin, otherwise known as Chim, and I do actually have a face. I was just showing off my new PNG tuber. Hello, I do have a face. It's a very nice face, some people have said. Welcome. Uh, lots of first time chats. Twisted Barbie, welcome back. Eddie Vassalini. Vassalini? Vassalini, welcome in. Uh, J2, J7, Banwell, welcome. Blueza, welcome in. I hope you have all had an absolutely fabulous stream. Do you have a Chimkin hat? If so, sold. Wait, 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 wait. I can give you two chimkin, ha chimkin hats, right? I can give you two. They're not real, but one day. One day. So if you just bear with. If I do this, right? I, I can do... I can do this. Right? So it's sort of... It's sort of a... It's sort of a thing. It's sort of a thing, right? And I got my new... <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome to the Bot Bot Brigade. Do not let the pow go to your head. I'm just a random cluck, bearded cluck. man on the internet. J2J7 Banwell has just joined the Bok Bok Brigade. Barbie, how was your stream today? Did I miss what, what were you playing? I missed it. You were playing Rimworld. How is Rimworld? Is everybody alive and not on fire? Eddie Vassalini, welcome in and thank you too. Welcome to the Bot Bot Brigade. Do not let the pow go to your head. Cluck, I'm just a cluck. random bearded man on Eddie the internet. Eddie Vassalini has just joined the Bok Bok Brigade. You've joined me mid-intro. I've yet to even start streaming, so thank you very much for the raid. I appreciate it. Um, I watched a Rimworld stream recently, and they set themselves on fire by accident because one of their members was a pyromaniac. I That game terrifies me. It looks so all over the place. It was great. Thanks. I'm actually surviving also with the Billy the, Billy the Puppet face paint. I'm going to have to go check out that board afterwards. Did I drop you a follow when you followed me the other day? I don't remember. I didn't. I've dropped you a follow. Thank you very much. I'll go check it out after stream. Bok, 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 yes, I got a new PNG tuber. It is both here. That's not me speaking. That's just that's just the thing. But this 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 I got this I received from the artist today, and I am so freaking in love with it. You have no idea. I'm gonna shout out the artist because they are also a Twitch streamer. Um, and I want to get it right, so I am going to go very quickly to go, uh, to very quickly to Twitch to make sure I'm using their right username. Uh, there's a clip of the paint, I think. Cool. Okay. Um, the artist of this PNG tuber is Smilky, otherwise known as Dylan, otherwise known as Smilky Shake, and they are absolutely great. I am so in love with this thing, you have no idea. I am going to start working it into various stuff as soon as physically possible, but Look at him. Look at him. The only thing is, it's not got my beautiful bald head in. But that's neither here or there. It's perfect. I love it. Okay. Um, I have to do an intro, which feels really weird sometimes after a raid. So thank you very much for the raid. I appreciate it. You're going to be just, you're just in time to see all the random gump I talk about at the beginning of my streams. It's very exciting. Um, let me scroll back up. Let me scroll back up. First, everybody, raiders, we do this because we like to catch up on chat because loads of people spam things whilst I'm going live. So I will not be responding to new messages for a couple of minutes while I catch up on chat. Wistan, welcome in and thank you for the quiet hello. Dolly Whiskers, congratulations on the first. Vulcan, that didn't, that did nothing. There we go. Second time's a charm. Um... <laughs> I misfired. Apparently that button misfires sometimes. I don't entirely understand why, but here we are. Vulcan Ryan, hello, and congratulations on the gifted first, because when my mods get first, sometimes I like to give out a first point as well. Happily ever, Kyra, welcome in. And thank you for the contribution to the channel point redeem. C 
community challenge thing. I have a spiel relating to this. If you go to my channel point redeems right now, at the top that there is a community challenge for anybody that is new to the channel. That ch community challenge will be refunded at the end of the month. It is a thing that we do on my channel. It is all about saving channel points up for longer periods of time so people can achieve like the 100k ones or the 500k ones or one day the million one that might make me stream for 30 days straight. So... Yes, if you would like to go do a community challenge, redeem. That's it. Happily ever, Kara. Thank you for that redeem. I don't necessarily read out every one of these redeems because it can get, it can get, there's a, I get a lot of them throughout. So please go do that. Happily ever, Kara. Thank you. Dolly Whiskers. A Kara frog shows up at your door before you can make sense of what's happening. A copy of Spook Science Tackles the Afterlife by Mary Roach smacks you in the face. Okay, now we get, now we get technical. I press this button. I go over here. I load Google. Multiple buttons are being pressed right now. It's very impressive. I hope you're impressed by buttons. Okay. What I am going to do is get past this menu music because holy shit, that's overstimulating. Give me five seconds while this boat falls over. Ignore that. It's, it's fine. It'll buff out. It's fine. Is the music going to stop? Okay, the music has stopped. Passive chickens. Good. Okay, so, uh, Spook. This is Dolly Whiskers' book that they have been smacked in the face with. The best-selling author of Stiff and Bonk trains her considerable wit and curiosity on the human soul. What happens when we die? Does the light just go out and that's that? The million-year nap? Or will some part of my personality, my meanness, persist? What will make? What will that feel like? What will I do all day? Is there a place to plug in my laptop? In an attempt to find out, Mary Roach brings her tireless curiosity to bear an array of contemporary and historical soul searchers, scientists, schemers, engineers, mediums, all trying to prove or disprove that life goes on after we die. See, do my partner Dolly Whiskers, who is also one of my mods, put this redeem together that gives us a book every once in a while. And I, I think it, I still am on the on the side of the fact that it is designed to make me read books. Because every once in a while, I just get an additional one to add to my list. Because that sounds really interesting. I don't know about anybody else. I would happily read that. Happily ever, Kara. A Kara frog shows up at your door before you can make sense of what's happening. A copy of No Idle Hands. The history of American knitting smacks you in the face. I have... I I know something about knitting. Dolly, again, referencing my partner, two books in a row. Dolly Whiskers tried to knit once and couldn't do it. They struggled because they are chronically ill and couldn't deal with the, 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 this, the this bit. And I picked it up and tied a knot for the first time in my life first try because I famously can't tie knots. It's not something that I can do. And apparently I can knit and I'm not sure... I, I, I can do well I can do the basic knitting knot and I without really trying and I don't I don't understand that personally because I've never been able to tie knots in my life fascinating what is remarkable about this book is that a history of knitting can function so well as a survey of the changes in women's role women's roles over time an historian and lifelong knitter Anne McDonnell expertly guides readers on a revealing tour of the history of knitting in America. In No Idle Hands, McDonald considers how the necessity and the pleasure of knitting has shaped women's lives. Also normalize men knitting. Um, not to do away with the historical re relevance. But if you want to knit, guys, please. I want to see your knitting. I want to see your knitting creations. Uh, Vulcan Ryan, we've done you. Penguin Queen Lucy. How's it going, Lucy? I hope you're doing okay, and I hope you have eaten some food. Have you eaten some food? Are you generally living today, Lucy? Did you sleep last night? Please tell me. Sky Alakar, welcome in. Sky Alakar, a courier frog shows up at your door before you can make sense of what's happening. A copy of Pirate Queens, The Lives of Anne, Bonnie, and Mary Reed by Rebecca Alexandra Simon. That sounds very much up your street, Sky. Uh... Pirate Queens. I mean, I like the artwork as well. I'm kind of in love with that artwork a little bit. Between the or between August and October 1720, two female pirates named Anne, Bonnie, and Mary Reed terrorized the Caribbean in, a, in and around Jamaica. Despite their short career, they became two of the world's most no the, of the notorious. 
became two of the most notorious pirates during the height of the 18th century golden age of piracy. In a world dominated by men, they became infamous for their bravery, cruelty, and unwavering determination to escape the social constraints placed on women during that time. Despite their infamy, mystery shrouds their lives before they became pirates. Their biographies were recorded in Captain Charles Johnson's 1724 book, A General History of Pirates, depicting the two women as illegitimate illegitimate women raised by men who against in, against insurmountable odds crossed paths in the south and became pirates together but how much is fact versus fiction uh fun fact about our and bonnie zombies welcome in and thank you for the first time chat i hope you're doing well today zombies um fun fact about Anne bonnie she used to bear her chest to men she killed so their dying thoughts would be that they were bested by a woman boxy blue a compliment for me I'll think about that. Let me catch up on chat and then I'll come back round to the compliment to myself. Thank you very much for the compliment though. It does make me it does make me think about actually if I'm any good or not. Twisted Barbie again, thank you for the raid. Twisted Barbie, hello. Eddie Vasolini, hello. J two se J two J seven Banwell, hello. That's gonna be a bit of a mouthful. If there is a J two J seven, if there is a way that you prefer me to refer to you by username and so on. Do people call you Banwell? J two, okay. Look at that frog butt. What frog butt are we looking at? Wait, which frog butt are we looking at? Um, Blueza. Samuel or J2? Great. It's twisted enough. Barbie raid. Um, Blueza, welcome in. Um, hi, Raider Skylarkar. Welcome, Raiders. I've said, I'm just reading my own chat again. Twisted Barbie, J2, J2, Twisted Barbie, J2, I've read all this. I'm great. Survivor, I need to check out face paint. I'm going to remember that after stream. Uh, I shouted out Smell Keys on Beans is there. We read about pirate boobs. And we're back to complimenting Chimkin. I was expecting that to take a lot longer and I've not thought of a compliment for myself. Um, chat, we struggle to consider us we. I'm not referring to myself as the royal we. Um, I struggle to like have positive feelings based off my own skills so that there is a channel redeem that makes me compliment myself and actually like think positively about my own whatever the hell's going on with this today um my compliment to myself will be i know i know i i know it's a really it's a really it's a really it's a really silly one it's a really silly one once upon a time in the late 90s right right bid chimp can neither can neither confirm or deny he got into game boy advanced emulation um, like I played a lot of Game Boy Advance games on an emulator in the, I fear, like I might have, I might have, because I'm not confirming piracy in any way. Um, I might have done that a long time ago or not. You'll never find out. And I, at the time, because I'm a nerd, apparently looked up a bunch of the laws, um, with regards to whether or not you can ethically emulate games. Uh, in 2024, it's massively important that some people do emulate games on the understanding that there are massive, there's like a massive drive online to archive and historically preserve all video games that have become previously and come previously. And there are uh, there are certain video games that you have to do that, like you have to emulate because the car, the car, the technology just simply doesn't exist anymore. Um, but I was talking about with this and somebody in DMs and they said and they they actively said to me with the way that I wrote like i typed it out do you have to deal with this stuff at work or do you just have a weird amount of general knowledge on this subject and apparently i explained it in such a nice way they thought i was informed so right big jimkin informed on emulation law which probably isn't relevant anymore because i was quoting what i read back in like 2001 um just in case i ever considered piracy but i never did it I never did it, not once. By your webcam, look at that frog butt. Look at that frog butt. Also, yes, there are new people in chat, so I would like to introduce you to a few on-screen components. We do have corner frog. This is one of my actual frogs. My, me and my partner have two frogs. Uh, one is called dumpling, one is called soup. This is soup. So say hello, soup. You say nothing because you're a JPEG. And up here, up here, this is really hard because I struggle with the mirroring of my arm. This is corner George. They, they, do you get why they're called corner things? Because they sit 
they sit in they sit in corners it's not that deep um i might have played robot wars for pc and still do robot wars oh god i remember the robot wars game boy advance get again robot wars pc let me get rid of this arenas of destruction is that the one we're talking about oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah. i remember the i remember these yeah i remember these do they still do Robot Wars or did that die a death? I remember that sort of like coming back for about five minutes and then going away again. Do they do they do they still do any format of Robot Wars on a regular basis? I imagine there are still people out there making robots to fight each other. It's back. Does it does anybody in chat know if I mention a TV show called Scrap Heap Challenge or was that very specifically British? Do you know what Scrap Heap Challenge is? We're getting in we're getting into the deep the deep like l early tv lore i know that freaking it was um it was the guy from red dwarf robert llewellyn yeah robert llewellyn i'm from i'm from wales that's why good i am a i am i'm welsh on my mother's side hello fellow welsh person i know it but i'm in the uk that's barbie that's twit i would like to say I would like to say though we have confirmed we have confirmed up until li i had been streaming for two years i've recently had my two-year anniversary twisted barbie and you're responsible for this not just not just you but i have recently had my two-year anniversary and up until recently i could count on one hand the number of uk based people that i had in my community like we're not i'm not i don't have ten thousand followers i in no way have ten thousand followers but like out of 500 to have five british people that i could actively think of um felt quite low but more more uk people are coming in i'm on the uk people radar i'm i'm gonna i'm gonna like it's it's a thing that's happening scrappy challenge was amazing yes for any for any Americans or people that aren't familiar with the concept of Scrap Heap Challenge, it was one of the guys from Red Dwarf, Robert Llewellyn, and there were two opposing teams, right? And they would be released into a sort of... It wasn't an, it wasn't an actual scrapyard. They were released into a scrapyard, and I swear certain components were placed within the scrapyard that would be useful. But they would have to go in and build something from the scrap in this scrapyard to um to to solve like a like a need like this week we're building catapults out of cars it's a thing mine are most nl based somehow i just I, I i've always put it down to the fact that i started streaming around this time so it's generally around the time americans might be tuning into twitch and it's not a pro it's in no way a problem but it's actively nice for people to be confirming that they're in the uk because when i make references like scrap heap challenge people know what i'm talking about and they're like oh unless yeah yeah people generally know what i talk about when i'm when i mention stuff like that but welcome thank you um we're actually going to play a game we're going to play a game and it's going to be super special great we are playing a plague's tale requiem which uh, we are very much all, almost we're well over halfway through mr blobby is our prime minister don't tell that he, he might as well be considering the state of our politics we do not talk about politics let's roll that back i mentioned the p word i must it's it's terrible okay um we're playing a plague's tale requiem there we have had a raid so i'll very quickly i uh, i've i very quickly summarized the concept of a plague's tale requiem and the previous game of plague's tale innocence cutting the story short we have two characters. One is Amicia, the older sister. One is Hugo, the younger brother. Hugo has magical powers. He can control rats, but the rats are all also plague carriers. So where he is going, a plague is being spread. And A Plague's Tale deals with the journey of them trying to find some level of cure to this thing that he's got. It is called the Macula. It is this sort of entity within him that allows him to control the rats but also sort of like wreaks havoc everywhere he goes because the rats slowly follow him and as the story progresses he slowly learned how to deal with his powers the idea being that eventually they will kill him we're not entirely sure what that format's going to take but eventually he will just expire and then sometime in the future another person will be born with the macula and then the whole the whole the whole uh 
circle begins anew. Like every once in a while, there's all, there's a plague that's sort of developed, and it comes from one of these people that is born into the sort of this genetic that comes from this genetic line. Last time on stream, having been informed by a dream, Hugo went to the Isle of Lacuna uh, with Amicia. We went around the island and discovered all sorts of various secrets and were sort of brought to the center of the island where we burst a hole in the floor and we went down into this series of catacombs, catacombs, however you pronounce that word. And at the base of the catacombs that we found at the bottom of the island, um, there was a previous um, carrier of the macula. And as it turns out, this carrier of the macula had been locked away. He had been chained up, he had been locked away, and the thing that had drawn Hugo there was the um, locked away carrier's malice. He had sort of summoned him there to continue his uh, sort of sort of wreaking havoc because he had been locked away from his equivalent of Amicia who are who plays the role of prote protector it's carrier and protector Amicia is the big sister they protect Hugo um the person that had summoned him to this basement had long since died and had long since been separated from his protector which drove him a little bit sad and he had killed a bunch of people down there and he had been the origin of a previous plague um, we resolved that by fleeing the scene. Um, it was all very family, like, Hugo, you're not going to die, I'm your sister, and you're not going to die, we'll be okay, etc, etc, etc. We escaped the collapsing cave. Our friend Sophia returned to the boat to prepare it for us to leave. However, we were summoned back to the palace of the Count that, uh, that rules over the island. Um, he is in charge of a cult, and as it turns out, he had created the cult to appease his very twisted wife who had taken it upon themselves to say they want to keep hugo and because they want to keep hugo amicia has to die um at the end of yesterday's stream we sort of resolved this by killing the wife with our magical rat powers and we were sort of sucked into the basement the ground fell away beneath us and we fell into the basement the idea being is we are sort of rejoining the characters today we are going to be escaping I guess um there are other spoilers tucked in there but I, w I, w I won't go too much further into detail we have been reconnected with a previous character called lucas who is an alchemist um and they are our friend and they are helping us get away um amicia is quite badly wounded and hugo is uh fairly despondent for reasons that i imagine will be made apparent today um yeah that's it so strap yourselves in thank you very much for being here and we will be playing we'll be playing rat game i we are on what's that 13 i think this game has 18 chapters i don't know if we're finishing today but depending on how today goes we might be finishing this game friday and i already have a future game lined up so i'm kind of excited i I'm really digging this story. So if as much as I've just thrown a shit ton of spoilers at people in chat, especially from people on the raid, if you have any inkling that you might want to play these games, I will say don't feel that you have to stay and watch me. Um, please consider trying these games yourself because they're absolutely fantastic. And the more people that buy them, the more chance that there will be a third game. And I want there to be a third game. You don't have to watch me. I appreciate the raid. Um, if you need to raid and run, raid and fade, whatever your cool term of saying that is, please do so. And thank you. Okay, we're in a hole, everybody. Can I run? No, this is as fast as I can go. Dead cult members everywhere, always a good sign. I mean, she's pretty injured. Dro, welcome in. What were you exactly... What exactly was she expecting to happen? We have to fix it. Do it. God. We are, we are 30 minutes... It's gonna hurt. We are 30 minutes into a stream and we're already dealing with dislocated bones. That always stresses me out. Who 
Are you all right? Hugo is a creepy kid. Come on. Hugo, let's go. How often do you have broken or dislocated stuff? It's it's one of those tropes, right? If somebody takes a fall or a stumble, they do the whole, oh yeah, they have to bang their arm back into the socket. I've seen it in movies. I've seen it on TV. It stresses me out. I've never had to do it in real life. And I, God, please, I hope I never have to Watch deal with dislocated him. limbs. I'll be quick. Mel Gibson did yes. it best. True. I've done it myself. Ugh. I, 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 the concept upsets me spiritually. Like, there's a component of that with the bone clicking and the popping. And what happens if something uncomfortable gets trapped as you do it? My shoulder pops out every now and then. No, not full dislocation, but not right. What happens if you pop it back in and something gets pinched? I would do it to your, uh, I would do it to yourself too. What happens if something gets pinched? Please tell me. Is, Come on. is it as bad as I think it is? Anything will help. Uh, you need it. I've got nothing. It doesn't? Like, surely if you're pushing something back into the joint, something could get pinched. There is. Don't pinch nerves. I don't know. It's never gone badly. I hope, for God's sake, it never goes badly. Because My shoulders are itchy because of this conversation. There has to be a way out. Are we not concerned that that angry bald man is going to come back and Look, find us? Up there. An opening. It's our way out. How do we? The upper floor. There may be things up there we can use. I'll look. Stay with him. Amicia, you're still hurt. Try to bring him back. However you can. Please. Fine. But don't go too far. Is this the way we're going? Well, Hugo. Block. I think you can hear me. Can't move this thing from I'm here. I'm sorry. I need to know if you're right. Skin's pale. The macula's mark, though, it, it looks larger. Must mirror the spread inside your mind. Uh, Dad, come see your up eyes. there. <coughs> Pupils not dilated. You're barely blinking. Okay, there's the thing there. Can I jump this? No. I'm just assuming that I can't. I can't get up there either. How do I start this puzzle? Can I go back the way I came? Question mark. No. No. Maybe? No. <coughs> A pole with a rope. What do you mean a pole with a rope? Where's the pole with a rope? I'm assuming she means that one. Ah! <coughs> Keep going. Good. Break medieval breaking and entering's finest. The question you have to ask yourself is why do all of these docks do doors that exist in this game seem to be locked with bandages on the inside? Okay, so now we can do this. Come on. <laughs> oh no, pull it back. Recently dislocated shoulder moving furniture seems like a really good idea. Hold on. Oh, you have to hold on. Up there is the thing. Money. Money, 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 money. No, just pa just paperwork. I can't. <laughs> oh, please. <laughs> please. How am I going to do this? I would also like to remind everybody that this game is horrendously bleak. <laughs> please. Really intriguing. But if you're not in a good I mood can't. right now, Help me. it might not be for you. <laughs> Lord. 
Stop. Stop. Stand up. Stand up and go. I don't see myself fighting anybody anytime, anybody, anytime soon. Depicting how modern day people probably imagine the plague times. Oh my god, is that a spooky dwarf? Oh! If you can hear my voice. I've got a new thing, chat. Things. Do you want to see a new thing? I need somebody, to, do you want to see my thing, chat? Would you like me to show you my thing on the internet? I'm going to need a yes or a no, but I'm going to give no further context. No. You don't want to see my thing. No. Ah. Oh. Be careful. I'm going to show you my thing anyway. Look away. That's something. Good work. We'll try to climb up. <laughs> yes. That's it. That's my thing. Are you? All right. You thought I yes. meant my willy. I didn't. Which is not the place for that. Oh, I thought it would be something else. Yeah, Amisa's moaning in the background was well timed. I tried to make oh, it. Is he? His mind is extinguished. I, I think it's not just the shock, it's the macula. So he's not coming back? Not yet. Let's use this thing. Come on, Hugo. The macula has taken over him. Again, they're leaving me the dislocated shoulder girl. It's and now stuck. we're stuck. It's too high. There's no other way, Lucas. <sighs> Mesia, let's push and see what's behind. I'm sure it's not rats. <clears throat> oh, no. Turns out it is rats. It's a lot of rats. Oh. They extinguished the flames. We saw those things inside the carrier's tomb. It will kill the sun. What? The sun killer. The light devourer. It's the nebula the old texts talk about. It's real. I'm home. No. No! This isn't home! Hugo, look at me! It's not him, Amicia. It's the macula talking, trying to fill the void, left by your mother's death. I... I should have saved her, but... We can still finish this. You hear me, Hugo? We can find that bastard Count and kill him! No, enough! Amicia, we need to leave this damn rock and take him away from here. No, it wasn't. It was it was not deserved. He's drowning. Amicia, focus. You need to push back. Talk to him. Keep him afloat. The crazy uh the crazy cult leader wife slit her throat. He needs you. Alright. Alright. Like I said, pretty damn bleak. Oh, this seems like a really good idea. Can't actually expect us to go in here. Oh, this this just seems like a terrible idea. Where's Arno? Arno hasn't shown up. I thought about this after stream yesterday. They took our French friend Arno the wall into into a prison, and after the what all of this shit happened. There has been no further mention of him. I'm wondering if we're going to bump into him on Stay our way out. Close. The 
the nebulas all around us. Mind your torch. Yes. Hey, watch out! Oh, what is... <coughs> That's what I was talking about. <coughs> Stay away from those fumes. <coughs> it burns! Stay cautious. There's more. I see them. I don't like the idea of these rats just dating in things. Like, I'm, I, the rats just dating is kind of just a line Careful. that <laughs> I really hope they wouldn't cross. Anything. Right before it'll burst. I told you, his bond with the macula is getting stronger. I know you're still there, Hugo. Please hold. Also, I swear they, that whoever designed this game clearly watched Alien. Is this not Z this? This looks so xenomorphy. It's unreal. Don't get me wrong. I like the Alien franchise. That's not a that's not a criticism. Just pools of low hanging cloudy just yeah, it's very Would you rather a xenomorph tornado? No, I would rather xenomorphs are Xenomorphs are scary. But you see what I mean, right? Aesthetically, this is very oh, alien Bloody franchisey. Hell. We need to be more careful. I mean, I didn't even see that. I hear that screeching right now in my head. Lucas, there's something ahead. Also, there's a large I ginger cat. What the hell? Oh my god, I thought it was a giant spider for a second. I saw that thing over there and thought it was a spider. It cannot be. How many are there inside? Xenomorph tornadoes. Yes, I'm here. Hey. I'm waiting. Let's go, Lucas, now. Yes. Come, Hugo. No! I'm staying. There is nothing here for you. This is home. This is... Stop! You're coming with me, whether you want to or not. You hear me? He's coming with me! You made us so angry. The giant, the giant... They're coming! Run! Oh, great. Oh, oh. Oh, great. Stay close to the wall. Quick, they'll tear this place apart! Don't look back! Run! There's a drop here! Don't slow down! Don't go down quick! We're running again! Oh, this is so bad! The sunlight's at the back! Run to it as fast as you can! <laughs> Damn you! Damn you! We're getting out of here! You won't take him! Do you hear? The pickup and the pacing of this game is incredible. Had you asked me Breathe. two hours ago how this would go, I was not going to call this. Hugo? Hugo? Don't turn your back on zombie child. His eyes look more human suddenly. See? There's still light.
We're not done yet. We should go. Her hair is really pretty. Yes, I'm ready. It, it used to be longer, and then she got went we got the injury, and the they harbor. sort of trimmed it back at the sides. I've never seen, like, here is short, and then she's got the ponytail. I've not. So she lost her braid. She had a braid up until they cut it off in the last scene. Reach the surface. Are we not at the surface? No, that was a, that was the previous. Sorry, that was the previous quest thing. Oh look, the city's on fire. Wait, the village. There's something wrong with the sea. The land is gone. It's me. No, I did this. The rats did. I did. I did it. No, the Count and Countess did. Let's go. Let's just go. How do we get back to the boat if the boat's... Oh, goodness. The tremors brought those bloody eggs out in the open. Yes, they're still here. Always. Uh. Always in my head. Hugo? Let him, Amicia. You are not in charge. I am the one in charge. Oh, no. You obey me. You hear me? You obey me. All right. I think they heard you. No, I think they. I think. I've never seen you do that. Because it hurts. I'm sorry. I. 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 I think they obey him. <sighs> Tremor wrecked the oil jars. Soldiers. Why do we still want the child? He'll be the end of us. He ruined everything. This happened because he's under the influence of that defiler girl. That's why the Count wants her dead. At all the Count's still alive. And that's why. Huh. Oh, that's one. Found them! <laughs> Just let us go. That's stealthy. Defiler girl. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't pop the giant rat cloud. I still haven't unlocked the ability to pick up my arrows, and I'm I'm irritated by that. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say we should probably avoid standing close to those giant odds. How many have they deployed here? How many have they deployed here? I see an armored fellow in the distance. Another one there. I pick up some crystals while we're here. They still want you dead, even in the middle of this mess. They'd rather kill someone than face their own end. Nothing new. What do we have here? Always time for loot, chat. Always time for loot. I don't like the way that the ground has gone all funny coloured. I miss cut. How deep does this thing go? There's not a rock left visible. I don't want to know. I miss green. Does anybody else miss green? Also, this has to be the longest night in this entire game. Like before, it would go dark and then eventually the sun would come out again. I know the implication is that the nebula, which is the cloudy stuff that's in the air, is blocking out the sun, but still.
Oh, hello, friend. I see you there. Do you like... Uh, there's one in the distance. Crossbow man in the distance. like to be in this grass that's ahead of me. It irritates me. These guys don't seem like they're gonna turn in the right direction. Because if I get them on the same spot... Hugo, are you still alright? Later. Almost, Here almost. Recover. What? <laughs> you idiots. Now I know where you're hiding. Over here. Don't let them escape. He found us. large armoured man on his way. I heard... I heard... Arm I heard armoured rustling. I mean, setting fire to them might have been a little bit dramatic. Toasty! Good screaming. I think, yeah. The audio in this game has been very good. That gate up there. I think it's the village entrance. What's left of it? There he is. One of their tricks for sure. Will pay dearly. Hey, that did not kill him. Uh, I don't particularly want to waste the arrows, but I've got no other choice against an armored man. Both of my arrows gone. Shit. Oh, this. Oh, fuck. That would have been that would I've been I would have been able to use them. That was foolish on my part. I've used my arrows. Hello, you're dead. Can I have your stuff? Thank you, please. Saying that over and over again makes it more likely or less likely. So she is a bit of a broken record on the subject, and I feel like that is entirely valid, don't get me wrong. But she keeps saying it, and things keep getting worse. This maybe. <clears throat> Alright, it's. <gasps> well, let's go quick. I wonder if the implication here was that I could have done this entire thing without being spotted. Come on. Up. Up we go. Yes. Jim Kim doesn't do stealth games. We're in. I'm sure nothing bad will happen here. <sighs> Never mind the fact that there is an evil count out there somewhere that still wants to kill me because I killed his wife. There's a boat over there. <laughs> is that not... Yes. Please be alive. Please be alive. I can't believe our Countess is dead. I heard the Count is so devastated he won't even be there for the hanging. They built a gallows on the Harbour Square for Arno. They're hanging the walls? Damn them. I wanted to see that. <laughs> yes, me too. There's Arno for you, Drone. He's not dead. He needs us. We don't have time. We must go. Really? 
even after what he's done. <clears throat> All right. We need to reach that harbor anyway. We let's, get Arno on the way and we get out of here. Let's go rescue a Frenchman. Careful with the drop here. All right. Hey, they're still definitely angry with me. We have confirmed. to lock on his <laughs> I love that move that move is cool okay, but how do we get rid of man there Turn the lights back on. Stay over there, rats. Oh, rats. Three minutes till an air chat. We will take a three minute break. Remember to grab yourself a drink, grab yourself a snack, hug a loved one, really sniff a beloved. I'd really like to meet someone who doesn't want to kill us. Sniff a beloved family animal. Sorry, I'm stealth in. Grab yourself. I don't think I could I don't think even I could accomplish that in three minutes. Even I. Uh chest over there. Remember to hydrate, Spoopy. In the three minute ad break, you're gonna hydrate, aren't you? You're gonna get a drink, and you're gonna be, you're gonna get a drink. Get a drink. Otherwise I'll fight you. I never imagined the rats could reach such power. That's how they'll stay here once we're gone. That will depend on you guys. I would like that arrow that is there. But if I leave during the break, then it's technically no longer a break and I don't have to hydrate. Sick a sick? Sick a sick? Sick a sick? Sick a sick. Welcome in. Thank you for the first time chat. I hope you're having a good day. Sick a sick. Oh, hell. oh, there's somebody there. I didn't see him. What's moving there? Better take a closer look. We have to hide. <laughs> Completely wrong. Is that the best you can do? It's chick a chick. Okay. 
That man just killed himself with a firebomb. That man just threw a grenade whilst he was covered in... Oh. That, that man just killed... Him. <laughs> it's all going south for them. One of them just unleashed some rats in the canyon. The other set himself on fire. Ad starting soon, chat. We are going to take a three-minute pause. I will be back in three minutes. I'll see you then. Uh... On screen instructions, you'll see them. Welcome back. Let's not set ourselves on fire. Um, when I like to escape the evil island full of cultists, I like to not set myself on fire. You're done for. They've seen us.
Well, there's a man in that room. It was useless to flee. They found us. I got him. Can we go over there now? I'm trying to leave. Needlessly complicated. He's all jammy and stuff. You can see his bare butt cheeks. Ew. I like stuff. I like things and stuff. Give me things and stuff. Things and stuff. When I immolate my enemies, I like to not look at their butt cheeks. That's a strange thing to say. Yeah, we're fine. We're finally through this very large, irritatingly complicated to cross room. But there's a rat in the room. I think I could have done this stealthier, but it's me, and I don't think anybody expects that at this point. Got one crossbow bolt. One crossbow bolt, chat. No, you know what, chat? You don't. I don't have one. I've got two crossbow bolts. That doesn't look very appetizing. Climb up. There are meant to be more soldiers here, and have I killed them all? Any news from the palace? Nothing yet. The Count must be burying his spouse. That must be terrible. When you see what they do to the people they catch. Yes. We have our dead too. And most of them won't get a proper grave. Talk about brighter days. This place looks like proper hell. The child will fix this. The child did this. He did it because of her, but the Count will teach him. He'll show him the way to shine on the world. I just hope I'm alive to see it. I would really like not to have to hit him with two arrows to kill him. I can see an arrow down in the table there, so there's at least... Go damn G. Okay. We don't care. We gotta kill that man over there. I can totally just take out that one in the distance and I can see two entire arrows on the floor. Mm. Need to sneak. I muted myself. That's personal growth. Ah. Never be royal. Royal. 
I wish my throwing arm was a touch longer. I need to get to a recovery table because I've unlocked the ability to I've unlocked the ability to reco recover my arrows finally. Faster and more quietly. I was trying to remember. Faster from blows. I wonder if I can get down to... There are three soldiers here, right? And two of them seem to be a problem. If I can get behind that one to strangle him quietly. Like, how quietly is quietly? I feel like he's going to hear me through the window, right? Like, I feel like that's not near it, nearly enough distance. It's going to be the stealthiest kill you've ever seen from me. Yeah! Yeah! That wasn't a stealth kill. see that. Sleeping on the job again. The hell? Was there a flaming arrow minigun? No. There has not been a flaming arrow minigun. I'm sorry to report. Welcome, Minido. I hope you're having an absolutely fabulous day. Um, there was murder and more murder and more rats and then a little bit more murder before there was a tiny bit more murder after that. Like, there's, there's been a fair amount of murder. I'm not going to lie. And it's not all been, like, done by me. I reached tier 9 in Satisfactory, but that's about it. Otherwise, the day has been fairly standard. I mean, that's still pretty impressive, right? I'm still, like, languishing around tier 4. I am in the process of... I need to start making fuel. For, I need to start, like, refining and making fuel. And then I got to that, and it's been a couple of days since I touched it. I 
I got 130 hours on my save already, and holy damn, I put too much in game because it crashes non-stop. I thought the game... It must be bad, though, if that's the case, because I think... Isn't that game meant to be horrendously well-optimized? Like, isn't it known for being very good for that sort of thing? Like, the fact that you're crashing it has got to be... It's got to be impressive, right? Or at least that's my limited understanding. Alfred, it seems to be the only way to the other side of the village. Barely hanging above the water, but no choice, I assume. Oh great, we're going no across choice. We're going across a belfry that's accidentally formed a bridge. I'm sure this isn't gonna go badly at all. You will never be royal, royal. I have Royal by Lord stuck in my head. I'm sure this is fine and nothing bad is going to happen. I bet it's not going to collapse into the river. Yes. Now where's Arno? We must go faster. They're going to kill him. We're doing all we can. There were they flamethrowers. Did you see the flamethrowers? Were you in stream yesterday she when they had have medieval flamethrowers? And Sophia too. Oh, thank God. Let's see what can be done. I can recover my arrows now. Much better. Da, 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 da. That changes everything, which in a re is really dumb, but yeah, I, I now don't have to worry about ammo as long as I can find it. <clears throat> to be honest, I saw more bugs in 1.0 than I did back in 0 0.3, but the problem is that I'm using blueprints and one of them is wonky since I managed to get a lift outside the bounds of the designer and the game saved the blueprint with that lift, but then I cleared the designer and the lift stayed. As if I'm connected from the blueprint and that's when my crashes died. Ew. You did a glitch, you did. That sounds like a console issue and you're going to have to go into the console and tell it to delete something that shouldn't be there. Hacker bands, you know. Up we go. Farewell. Up we go. Throw your little brother over the wall. You know what I'm really looking forward to? And it's not that I'm enjoying the stream, because I am. But I'm going to have three slices of toast after this stream, and it's going to be delicious, because we've got nice butter at the moment. We need to jump down. And I'm sat here thinking about toast. Oh. It's the only thing that gets my mind off the murder. <coughs> you will never be royal. In Satisfactory's defense, I have seen very few glitches. The pipes don't seem to work like they should. A friend of mine had... I'm not sure what the issue... That, lads? <laughs> that roaring pig is all quiet now. Lord, let's go. We have to get closer. So this is the honor. <coughs> the one they call the wall. Yes. We have to save him. I'm not sure what the eventual Even if problem he was. It. I see. You put together quite the troop. Come, Lucas. We will introduce you to Daddy Arno. He's 100% not evil. 100%. Climb up. Up? Yes. Get up there. Ooh, how do I get that? I want to get that. I want to touch that. That's got stuff in it. Have I missed it? No, if I put the thing over there, I can get... Ooh. Ooh, there was a secret that I almost walked by. I don't have a knife to open it, but maybe there's one luckily up there. If there have been... I think I've seen about four knives the entire game. 
Up you go. And Come on. at this point, oh. they need to give all me right. more knives, is all I'm saying. Considering the ones I found have almost been by accident. A feather. You go, look. I don't know what it is, but would you like to have it? Why? Because you like them. Here, take it. Yes. It will be all right soon. Soon. It's not glitched. The game just let me. It normally blocks you from putting anything near the edges of the designer, but the input of the system I set up wasn't on the ground. It just let me connect a lift to it as if there it was in bounds. I did manage to delete it and edit the blueprint after that, but it seems one or two blueprints I put down before that are causing a lot of problems. That sucks. Especially with 130 hours in the game. I got no knife. Oh well, I will continue to use the defective blueprint until I can't launch the game. And then you just have to start again. Maybe you should start fresh, because it's a bloody masterpiece. You should start fresh. You know, really healthy thing to do. Just delete your save and start again. What's the worst that can happen? In line with the thing. Okay. Up. Up ski. Climb up. <laughs> I'd like to experience the 1.10 content, which is mostly tier 9 before that. DLB, welcome in. How's it hanging? Da -da 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 -da. This is the wall. <laughs> it's just like a pile of crap now. This place is falling apart! To hell with the executioner! Damn right. This what? bastard killed my mates. I'll do it myself if I have to. Kill oh, that's the close. Right. Crowded. The yes, get ready. There are jaws of tar right next to them. Now, Monsieur, do something! Give it to me. Did you come to finish me? Shut up! We're taking you out of here! Ah. What? It's her! The defiler! She has the child! Take him away from her! No! Stick with me! Trust her, Hugo. This is not just for us! This child belongs to the world! He's our future! Huh. I'm for it! You do this island! Be quiet! Ah. Ignore them, Hugo! We're here with you! We're going home! Come on! Kill the damn uh. bastards! Say. So much for being able to pick up my arrows. There's one. There's two. Where'd you get the rapid fire crossbow? Your turn. He's got the arrow stuck in him. Oh my god. Uh, the crossbow that I've had all along, I've unlocked the ability to carry more bits of uh, more pieces of ammo in it. Like at once. Oh god, I'm running out of shit. And he has got his shield up. 
We're gonna have to be strategical. God damn it. So you got machine gun? No. I balls that up. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away. I just need to kill the one guy, come on! Potato, what? Potato, welcome in. Where's the shield? I want my arrows back. I'll blind him. Take the child, whatever that costs. Oh, God. Hang on, Amicia. To you, Amicia. Shoot the feet. There's two of them. Are we done? No, bow and arrow, man. Oh, oh God. Oh, enough. Good. Now, do you mind taking this bloody rope off my neck? I do mind. Yes. Right. Ah, oh, concentration, shoot the feet. I did I can you can't you burn the shield? You but if they have the shield they sort of knock it away and it sort of goes near them. Oh my god. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm just gonna wander around this area a couple of times because it seems to be magically spawning arrows and like bits of gear and I feel like a stock up would be useful. Uh Reminder, we are playing this game on the hardest difficulty, so little glitches like this. It's not entirely cheating. I can't go up to that balcony where that man was. There's one. How many have we got now? That's three arrows. Push comes to shove. Oh, no. Heavy bastards approaching! You've done enough damage! Oh no! Hugo, stay the child here! And you'll get a quick death! Never! We're here to save you, child! Run! That'll do it! Bloody hell! It's over now. We did it, Hugo. Yes! Breathe. Calm down now. That's Friano, right? Yes. <laughs> Please. Oh, you can do rap volcanoes now. He, um, he, so much has happened since yesterday. Where did you watch the stream up till yesterday? Were you here till the end? <coughs> you were here, uh, you were here last night, right? I can't remember how much you saw. Uh, basically, he is... <laughs> more rat than boy now in summary more rat than boy i need to drink my drink for a sec <clears throat> come on no just for a flat i have time cut off at midnight and work days 
he um his his mum died and he went a bit crazy. Hugo says it was his. Um, and he killed a bunch of people using his rat powers and it sort of like allowed the macula to take over a more substantial part of his body. Deuce. Sophia! You took your sweet time. Come aboard. Go collapse somewhere. Wait. And your mother? She won't come back. We must go. Now. I see. I'll take it from here. You want to see him with a rat face and fur? She's never coming back. I know. I wanted to tell her a lot of things. Me too. But she knew everything already. You are her greatest gift. She loved you the way you are. The way she made you. They did a really good job with her emotions on her model. Like on her face, it just... It, it, they did a really good job. We will live. Oh cool, I love entering streams to trauma. The scars? We keep them so that we don't forget. We've not done a final boss. So that we can accept. Like, this feels like an ending and there's no ending yet. Until they don't hurt anymore. You the Amicia suddenly kidnapped. No, we have got, according to, I, we've got healing our wounds. Like, they're going to recover. There's still time to recover and it get worse somehow. Look at us, Kara. No matter what he streams, we've got you covered. Maybe her ponytail was the final boss. never get back. Not all of us did. But he'll get better now. We all will. You're not a little bit concerned like the mainland's just going to be on fire. Come talk if you want. All right. Oh, great. Fresh well, air. Was Pony a braid? It was a pony. Like, they had they had a braid down their back, right? And the, the, the guy chopped it off when he was angry with us. Hi. Passed out. Stay there. You don't want to wake up after this. Trust me. How's the view? It's nice. What's on your mind? Do you think I'm different? Well, I don't know. Are you hungry? Huh? <laughs> yes. Well, still the same. <laughs> I feel different. Things feel different. It's called growing up, Hugo. Some things just make it go faster. Yes? Yes. But we'll slow things down from now on. We'll take all the time we need. I can't wait to be in the mountain. Soon. Very soon. We're going home, Hugo. Our home. Yes. How much... What home are they going home to? Hello? Hey. Oh, hey. How do you feel? You first. But like the island of his, is that relevant in the story? Just like... No, we were just there. After a strange dream. Yeah, a terrible one. But I couldn't wake up until I dreamt it. Changed. Reborn. Almost. There's a home ahead now, Lucas. Will you come with us? Well, I think... You and Hugo are my home, so... Yes. We're glad to have you with us. I like him. Um, the island, we were called to the- we were called to the island for- by evil- evil, like, 
macular spirits in the basement. Um, and that was it. The the whole island with him, his dream and the phoenix and being healed and so on was a double bluff. Hey. I'm not sure that's a double bluff, but you know what well? I mean. I woke up thinking I was dead. I Been there. One. What will you do now? My mother... She had a house, an old house in the mountains. I promised him a chance to be happy. That's where we'll get it. Sounds nice. You'll always be welcome there. I know you don't like heights. Hey, people change. Follow the people with superpowers that are clearly trying to save the world. Probably a good idea. Abandon the boat. Go live a life Alicia, in the mountains. Come see. Is it dolphins? Is it rat-shaped dolphins? Hey, what's going on? Is he fine? Who knows? How about we ask him directly? All right. Sir? Are you alive? What do you think? Dead people don't talk. <laughs> Good catch. Hey. I'm sorry for... Well... Everything. Thank you for getting your sister to help me. You saved me. Look who finally decided to be nice. Don't make me regret it. There's still a chance for him to be evil. The war's over, Arno. We've all earned a rest. You should try it, too. <laughs> hey! Ship! Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Damn, the Count! One ship! It's ah, coming ah. fast. You see? That's the thing with war. <laughs> you don't get to decide when it's over. Oh, this can't be happening! We Go inside, Hugo. The main You'll be sail. safer. Keep steering. We'll hoist it. Amicia, up here with me. Coming! The others? They'll manage. Stay inside. Man the, the rope on the other hold. side. All right! All right. Oh, come on, faster! That bastard couldn't let go. We have to lose them. No, they board us. Done. Good. They're still closing the distance. No, no, no. What now? Turn the sail to the wind. We need a better angle. Which way is the wind? How do I tell which way the wind is? I'll give you some slack while you pull it towards you. Yes, we have no right to bail this Arno. We won't. It's working. We're picking up speed. But it won't be enough. We're They're coming. Heavy. Throw some cargo overboard. Throw some cargo. <laughs> Give me a hand, Amicia. Coming! Oh, I mean, with her body count, what's the fun? I'm sure the sling works on ships! Quick! I'll handle the cargo. Go! Right! Hold on! I'm coming! I didn't hear what- thought you could leave with my child! He's not your child, you lunatic! Touch him in your dead victim! Don't hurt the child! Kill the rest! You heard the count! Shoot! Shoot! <laughs> Go to hell! All of you! Yeah! No, no! Don't die now! No! <laughs> I didn't hear what she asked me to do right at the end. I didn't hear what she asked me to do. Fun fact, I sail IRL sometimes, and that type of sail would completely use us if you turned it to the wind. The main sail, you need a jib. Protect Sophia and Lucas. Yeah, that's what. You really thought you could leave with my child? He's not your child, you lunatic! Oh, touch him in your dead victim! Don't hurt the child! Kill the rest! You the count! Shoot! Go to hell! All of you! Those are just vertical wings. Oh, the frames! Yeah. 
So many frames. And I'm on fire and it's invisible. That cloud of smoke did not do good for my FPS. You really thought you could leave with my child? He's not your child, you lunatic! Touch him and you're dead, Victor! Don't hurt the child! Kill the rest! You are the child, shoot! Go to hell! All of you! Sophie needs to get out the fucking way! fell overboard yes but also the type of cell is just a big wind catcher so it turned to the wind caused the boat to go backwards oh um we seem to be we seem to be we seem to be in half there's too many Arno. not if there are two of us coming take that boat for the Count of Provence! Come here, Victor! Don't be a coward! For the staking strap, don't worry. You're next. You've killed that man! I'm enjoying seeing your men die, Victor! Focus on me! I'll leave the arm to see you, don't worry. I won't rest until this bastard's dead. Come on! Come! A dozen your corpses! The boat is done, Arno! We'll take theirs! Ah, you'll never get the boy! You hear me? Take them. This is where our war for tomorrow begins! There will ah. be no tomorrow! For anyone! Ah. No! We... We can do this! Ah. Keep coming! <clears throat> I'm getting warmer! Ah. You will die quicker! You don't deserve ah. that! Ah. He will serve a higher purpose. I'll spill your guts in the sea until it turns red. Give us back the child. How many are there? There are less and less. I am out of ammo. I'm out of everything. Yeah. No, no, don't die. There we go. Oh, it's got all sea of thieves now, yeah. There's crossbows, there's luxury pigeons. Oh my gosh. It's I'm so tired. It's been non-stop action all freaking day. You weaklings have to team up on me. Soldiers, kill that man! Ah, Enjoy ah, seeing your men die, Victor! Focus on her! We must I'll leave the arm to her. see you, don't worry. I won't rest until this bastard's dead. Then save your breath, old... Yeah. Go now! Ah. Don't die now! Come on! Come! I've done to your corpses! The boat is done, Arno! Ah. We'll take theirs! You'll never get the boy, you hear me? Take them down. This is where our war for tomorrow begins. There will be no tomorrow for anyone. No, we, we can do this. Keep coming. I'm getting warmer. You will die quicker. You don't deserve that child. You deserve a higher purpose. In the sea until it turns red. Give us back. How many are there? They're less and less. Ah. Come, Amicia! Stay inside! Shoot! No! no. Oh, fucking Amicia. hell! Amicia! Amicia! You killed her! Hugo, come with me!
Hugo, come here! <laughs> Sorry, child. The rats can't help you here. No! <laughs> Oh, he knows karate. Of course he does. It is merely a flesh wound. I threw Such and threw. A fragile little thing. I threw and All threw right. around the abdomen You've in won. this day and age would be a death Don't wish. Hurt him. hurt him. He's Emily's son. My son. He's a god. He's a god. You're a He's nutcase. He's our doom, Victor. You need to let him go to his sister. No. I owe this to Emily. With her, I tried so hard to believe this world wasn't just blood and war. That I could throw a blanket over these flames. But the truth is, people like us, we are born to feed that fire. Whatever you're planning with him, it won't work. He will destroy you. He'll destroy what I tell him to. We'll set this world aflame. And I'll forge an empire from that fire. A more righteous one. It's not over, you coward! You owe me blood! I paid that price already. Now my son needs to rest. Finish this! I'm, <laughs> I'm sure she wouldn't sink like a stone. Yeah, there she goes. What a cunt. <laughs> oh, God. I just, I just, I just want, a, I just want a nice, chill Plague's Tale stream. <laughs> there it is. Oh, damn you, you goddamn pig! Shh. Stop <laughs> shouting. Where's Sophia? For the pain. We use it on the battlefield. Have some meh. Have some battle meh. Hugo. I'm... I'm sorry. I was stuck. I had to pull us out or we'd be dead. We need to take him back. The Count knows what Hugo can do. We need to reach them before he... He hurts him even more. Let's go. Sophia and Lucas have gone ahead looking for horses. We like the child now. The, ch teeth. the child is okay. Chill out. <clears throat> Hugo, Hugo's God nice now. It. We like him. Yeah. Where the hell are we right now? Hold on, it'll kick in soon. Do we though? I like Hugo. The Count. Did he say something? You broke his heart, so now he wants war. I didn't he in said the first to use game. Your brother to conquer. There'll be nothing left to conquer. I know. Severe and Lucas. Shaken, but fine. The boy. He's the one who cleaned your wound. Is this Tahiti? He's good. It is not Tahiti. He went to the wreck to find supplies. <sighs> I'm so glad they're alive. They'll be through here. Come, take it easy. Don't go reopening that wound. Yes. I think your potion is starting to work. To think I could have killed that bastard count. You couldn't win this one, Arnold. Well, I don't like the child, not concept-wise, but performance-wise. He was not a great character in the first game. He is a massly, in it, like, I feel exceedingly sorry for him in the sequel. It's not his fault. Broke his heart. How wife you met? Yeah, I killed her. <laughs> it's ruined. It'll never sail again. It's got a giant hole in it. What were you expecting? Boats come and go. But it's the sea that keeps Sophia going. You know what I mean. Focus on what matters to you. Because when it's gone. Thank you. We'll get him back. The words of a true knight, Arno. The fuck? No. Really, I've never seen anything like you. 
Where's my brother, you bastard? Safely in my possession. Until he's ready to serve. Until he sees your head in a rag. And knows this old world must burn. Bastard! I'll handle him. Like hell you will. Listen to me for once, you damn mule. Why? So you can have your revenge? So that you can save your brother. I'll make him tell us where Hugo is. Cover my ass and stay alive. I'll handle this one. Can I just get kill the girl? Can I just get five minutes to chill out? I'm with you, my lord. Reinforcements are coming. Watch out! They're here. Lucas, are you hurt? No, but we can't move. Just stay alive. Yeah. Oh, we'll get you. You stupid bastard! What have you done with the boy? He's my son now. My sacred weapon. The child is with us now. You won't finish your evil work, defiler. Oh, I will, but I'll finish you first. Enter for goodness sake! <laughs> and I cut myself. See, that's what he does. When they get the shield up, they go pop, and it dislodges it very slightly. Yeah, the, the wife uh, slit our mother's throat, so we sucked her down a rat hole. I'm with you, my lord. Reinforcements are coming. Watch out. They're here. Lucas, are you hurt? No, but we can't move. Just stay alive. We'll get you out of here. You're going nowhere. You stupid bastard. <laughs> what have you done with the boy? He's my son now. My sacred weapon. No! Child. Let him pass. You won't finish your evil work, defiler. Oh, I will, but I'll finish you first. Enter, for goodness sake. I will, right away. Demolish them, girl. You're tougher than they are. Where did you take my brother? Answer that, and I may give you a quick death. Where's the boy? The time for compromise is ended with Emily. Now you die. Oh, he's getting... Why are you all so desperate to die? Your corrupted blood will soak this ground! I'll slay that witch myself! Don't underestimate her! I'm coming, Hugo! They can't stop us! He's my brother! Talk! Where is he? Why would I talk to a dead man? The child will save us all! We're losing time, Arno! We must fight Hugo before... Before Hugo! Stop your bullshit, Victor! Where is he? You don't care about <laughs> him! You just want to kill <laughs> me! Wrong! I want to save what I can! to the macula. Marseille. You took the boy to Marseille after what happened to your damn island? Shut up! I will take care of it! Open your eyes! It's too late! Now everyone will die! And he... 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 Oh no! We must leave now! You're not going anywhere. <laughs> what is that bloody thing? You damned idiots! Face the truth for once! It's your last chance! Why did you take up arms with this bitch? I know. To fill the void left by your son. Do not speak of him. His blood is on your hands. Captain Orca, okay. this war. battlefield is not battlefield. You um the when the macula reaches a certain cons co constitution when there's a lot of the rats together they start form forming a um effect called the nebula which has been revealed in the, this stream or so um it is a sort of airborne sort of 
essence that surrounds the rats in certain quantities and it is called the nebula because it was theorized that enough of the plague together would blot out the sun uh bruno's bruno hugo's powers have increased dramatically and therefore he's now creating it seemingly like nuclear explosions we abandoned us to the enemy but you can redeem yourself now give a noble command stop this madness no! let the boy go Madness makes this world We don't go talk round. about Bruno, no, 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 no. We don't talk about Bruno. A typical medieval, like medieval story, completely realistic medieval story. I'll leave just enough of you to tell me where you hit Hugo. So confident. Sir, we must evacuate now. No, we finish this. Can I just Kill shoot him? She's trying to save you, you assholes. May my face strike my arm. May it lead to brighter days! Emily is dead. She was the only chance to <laughs> attack him. Please, I beg you. It was a time for peace. But you had to ruin everything. Everything I had! You ruined it yourself with your life! Where the fuck is that guy? Your head, you slow. I'll make it pay you. Spend two months' time training with Dharma. They were better men than you'll ever be. Oh, God, I've opened the. God damn it. <gasps> Press the wrong button and opened the Steam tab. You had your chance to run. Kick him in the daddy box! Ah! Damn idiots! You're just proof that we don't deserve to live! Oh, here comes a large boy. I need ammo, quick. Ah. Can't see shit. Ugh. Last of my arrows. Can he just die to the fire he stood in now, please? He's 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 stood directly in fire. That just seems unfair. Apparently his oh, no. Apparently his arm oh, oh god oh, no. This is it You're too old or no too old to fight And you're so goddamn stupid Amicia is yours oh. It's over no. One count, ah, uh, ah. Uh. What can I do? You can stop shouting. I'm sorry, I... Please, don't... No. It's the right time. And... You gave me quite the last run. Ad coming up in one minute, chat. I will pause. He's a great boy. And you? You're all right, I suppose. And you? I know. You? You're a cunt. Oh, damn. We just got Daddy Arno back and he's dead. Everyone's dead. Great ending. No, there's at least two people alive. Hugo is a question mark.
At least we killed the cultists. It will kill the sun. The nebula. We're gonna pause. I'll be back in three minutes, chat. I'm gonna go over a little bit and least until I like I'm not sure how much longer of the game is left, but I I I wasn't planning on finishing it tonight. Um we'll be careful. I'm not going anywhere. BRB, go, go follow the on-screen instructions. <laughs> Okay, let's continue, at least for a little bit. And good night, Edo. You did it, you idiot. Now we all owe you. It's everywhere. The rats will spread unchecked. still have time does it matter let's just go make room i will take the reins i have to do something
Good news, everybody. We have a tank. Is this one of the flamethrower wagons that we had? How far are we from Marseille? Not too far, I'd say. Amicia, are you all right? No. I could have... You couldn't. I don't even know how you're even standing. You did all you could, and he knew it, Amicia. Besides, you gave him what he needed most. The Count's death. No. Someone to care for. A real purpose. Yes. Yes, he gave his life for us. I won't let it be for nothing. Now we need to find out where Hugo is. That's the problem. Marseille's a damn big city. The burst of the nebula probably left marks. Whatever's happening over there, Hugo must be at the center of it. How can we know? He's still alive. <laughs> There'll be signs. I hope. Wow. That kind of sign? Yes. It's him! But I don't think it's a good sign. What's that noise? Is it... coming from the city? It's coming from the ground! King Rat is here. We have to find her and leave. Run! Something terrible's happened in the city! What? Don't what happened? Way. Straight to the hills! No! No, the sea! Let's find a small boat! What's that damn rumble? Enough! You're scaring the children even more! The gates of hell have opened! Marseille is lost! It's the final chant of the macula. This is the end of days. We're all We seem to be going the wrong way. Get up, please, get up. I can't. My leg. You must. We need more people to help. You sure it'll hold? Marseille, they're barricading the gate. Why? Because that rumble is coming from the other side. But what about those still inside? They're dead already. Keep going. This what do is, we do? This is fine. There's another gate further on, but that hay is in the way. Wait, we have this cannon. You know how it works? <laughs> I don't know. Wait, you push here. That must be it. I've figured it out, I think. Go on, then. Ha! Whoa! Is that Greek fire? Yes, the camp recovered some carts built by the order. So we're going behind these walls? Don't think about it now. Here we go again! <laughs> Admit it, you're tempted for me to turn it on the soldiers. I can't Those fire when I'm not... not coming from the ground. No, they're coming from the city walls. It feels like a heartbeat. His heart commanding them. Can you imagine how many... So this is how it starts. What? Our punishment. What the hell? What's going to be a monster? Yeah. Use it now. <laughs> okay. What the fuck is this game? I swear to God, it's so good. But wow. Okay, I have to aim. Like, good news is I don't seem to have an ammo bar. Those tremors are not coming from the ground. No, they're coming from the city walls. It feels like a heartbeat. His heart commanding them. Can you imagine how many? So this is how it starts. What? Our punishment. What the hell? No. What's going to be a Done 
one chasing us? Looks like it. She's got to have brain damage by this point. Crazy times back then. I, rem I remember it like it was yesterday. Can you learn about this in school? Sophia! Over here! Looking a bit Who's worse for wear. Who's not? I don't think it's really much of a competition at that point with the wounded. We're here. I've never been to Marseille. I've never been to oh. Marseille. You came in the loveliest season. Let's go find my brother. King Hugo. You like King Hugo? Oh. And I thought you were unstoppable. I'm not. I just forget it sometimes. Lucas. I must Hi, say. Hi, Sanguine. It's an honor to have you by my side. You're the most reliable, steady. I think it's a combination of all three. Nice thing in the world. I don't know, <laughs> but uh, you're my family. You're sharing all this because you think you won't make it? You all still have a lot to live, so you'll make it. This is a damn order. He must live. He deserves so much better than this. Now, just watch your step. That's where we're going to leave it for another week. I'll be back on this game Friday. It's going to be a good old time. I think we're very much set to finish the game on Friday, and I've already got the next game I'm going to play set up. So. Boom. Pop. Um, great. Another good one. That was, what is it? It's Detroit being human. But we have to finish this first. I'm going to press this, just in case you've not seen it, because Rachel got this a little... Rachel got this, but I was switching to the BRB screen. So I'm going to press this now. This is a new one. Ready? <laughs> Also, ooh, woo. this. Hello, my name is Right Big Chimpkin, and I have a new one. Lol. Yeah, you scream directly into the microphone. Good. Okay. We haven't given George a treat today. I like the new profile pic. I'm so happy with it. It's come out really well. Um, I'll shout out Smelky again. Uh, shout out Smelky Shave. Go and drop Smelky a follow. They are the artists. They are absolutely fabulous. And they were very accepting of me and how I wanted. So get, go check them out. Um. Let's give this cat a treat. Uh, chat, I want you to know I'm glad you exist. I have so enjoyed... I've not finished it yet, but I'll say the words. I've so... I've so enjoyed playing this game for you. I've had a really wicked time playing it. 
Um, it was a community recommendation, and that is why I'm sort of moving Detroit Being Human into the slot that Final Fantasy was going to take back over. Um, Detroit Being Human was another community recommendation, and I think I, I want to lean into that. It seems like a really good game as well. It's been on my radar for quite some time, and it just happened that it was significantly reduced. So we're going to go straight into Detroit Being Human after we finish Requiem on Friday. Based off where we're at, I think we've probably got a little bit of a stream on Friday, and then we might get some Detroit Being Human done on Friday. But I'll, I'll see how it works out, because we've definitely got more Requiem. It's whether or not I finish it very early in that stream and then need to find something else to do for the rest of the stream. I don't know how that's going to work out, but I don't want to spoil myself. So we're just going to see. Um, chat! I want you to know that I'm glad you exist. Thank you for joining me with a Requiem so far. We're so close to finishing requiem and having been playing the mass effect trilogy and final fantasy and the various games that we've been playing the last couple of months it feels so nice to be that close to the end of two games that i'd forgotten what finishing games was like because mass effect is taking years off my life um so yeah i'm having an i'm having a really nice i'm, I'm having a really nice time thanks for stream thanks for lurking sanguine i appreciate a good old lurk um what do I usually say? I've said I'm glad you exist. At the beginning of my streams, I ask if there's anything you can be proud of me for. And now that I think about it, considering I had a raid at the time, I don't remember if I said it at that point. So I apologize if I didn't ask if there's anything you can I can be proud of you for. But in the meantime, at the end of my streams, I like to say something different. I like to remind you that I'm super proud of you for just living. Um, existence is rough at the best of times. Words are hard. Getting up out of bed for some people is a real struggle, and I am so proud of you for just existing and going about your day, even if, like, you can't get out of bed, because you're still here, you're still breathing, you're still perpetuating your own existence, and that is great. That is something to be proud of. You do not have to watch my content. You do not have to be in chat. You do not have to lurk in chat, though lurking is always appreciated. What I want you to do is take all of the energy that you've got, it might be a little, it might be a lot, and focus on existing and continuing to exist. And if my content can make your existence a little bit easier, that is the niche that I'm trying to fill on the internet. That's it. That's all I want to be. Um, if you would like to type fuck cancer in chat, it is a ritual that we have done every stream all year. It is continuing till... January 1st. Fuck cancer, basically. It is a ritual in response to a very important person that me and my partner Dolly Whisk has lost at the end of 2023. It has softened the grief for me somewhat uh, when I think about them. It is still sad. It is still grief, but it is... I think about you at the same time. I think about the community. I think about the people that I've met and the friends that I've met and so on and so forth and the good times and it just... It's helped. Um, and I will never, ever, really, probably ever stop saying thank you for that, because, yeah. I'm going to find somebody to raid, and then I will be back Friday at the usual time. Um, who's live right now? Who's live right now? Oh, Kara's playing Little Nightmares. I'm going to send you into Kara. Um, enjoy the rest of your day. Be very good to yourselves this week. Drink plenty of water. Take care of yourselves as best as you possibly can. I am super proud of you and for everything that you manage, big or small. Um, so it might be, it might seem simple to you, but it is not simple to me. I hope you know that our community is accessible. I hope you know that you are respected here as much as I possibly can. Because if, yeah. If you don't like cats, we might, we, we might, no, I'm not going to go down that line. You're great. Honestly, you're great. I've never met a bad person. Well, no, that's a lie. I'm just going to stop mumbling to myself again. Um, I'll just, I, I I'm just going to press this. Ooh, woo. Ooh, woo. I'll see you Friday. Start raid. So long, farewell. I'm gonna go and eat so much fucking toast. I'm re you're gonna like, you're gonna, you'd be impressed by the amount of toast I'm about to go eat. It's gonna be crazy. <laughs> <laughs>